everyone how are you welcome back to my channel i hope you all are doing well i am on a roll with the videos this week and it's making me very happy if you have any requests feel free to leave them down in the comments below while i have this free time i know some of you have already left requests and i made sure to take note of them so today i'm just showing you guys a few of the natural products that have been used up mostly um over the past few months if you are new to these videos so if you are new to these videos, I pretty much just share with you some of the things that I've used up and I let you know if I'll buy it again or not. So if you're in the market for whatever it is that I mentioned, you'll have another review on it. So let me just get right into it. The first thing that was almost completely used up, it'll probably be done in two or three days, is the Bragg's apple cider vinegar. Any apple cider vinegar will always do, but this is just what we usually get. I use apple cider vinegar for so many different things. My hair, for my skin as a toner, um, in the bath, on food, many ways. So if you're interested in seeing a video on all the different ways I use apple cider vinegar, go ahead and let me know. But we use this up. I, I do think it is a good idea to continue to purchase the gallon, especially if you know that you're just going to use it up. The next thing that I used up were these raw one for women daily multivitamin. I've used this before and featured it in another empties video. I will continue to buy it. I really like the Garden of Life brand of um, vitamins and I think all of my supplements are Garden of Life brands. So I will continue to repurchase this. It's just a really good multivitamin. Next thing is actually a tea and this is the Yogi Sweet Tangerine Positive Energy Tea. I purchased this with hopes of using it as a replacement to um coffee to quit coffee but that did not work out too well and i'm still currently drinking coffee but this tea was really good and it did give me the same kind of energy that coffee gives me nothing over the top or anything like that i probably won't repurchase this i probably will keep drinking coffee i don't know what has happened i have never been that much of a coffee drinker until sometime um in the middle of last year so fun fact i worked at starbucks for almost three years and i never drank the coffee i never liked coffee i did like the smell of it but never wanted to drink it unless we had to test it uh but now i'm like hooked on it and i know it's not the best thing but that is what it is for now anyway moving on the next product is this derma e vitamin e 12,000 iu cream i absolutely loved it you saw me feature it in my dry skin video i completely used the whole thing it is empty and i will repurchase this it has a really really light i think it's a cucumber scent and it is extremely moisturizing i love it mostly for my feet and my hands um, it doesn't leave a sticky residue or anything like that. I highly would recommend this moisturizer. Next thing that I used up, what, well, it wasn't used all the way up. It was probably like halfway done and then Marvin went ahead and broke the top off. But this is the Naked Organic Lip Balm by Dr. Bronner's. It is unscented. I love it. I use it morning and night. I also use it for Marvin. It is so moisturizing and just leaves my lips really hydrated. So the next thing that was used up was the Stairs Witch Hazel Aloe Vera Formula and this is the alcohol free toner. I really wanted to hurry up and get through this because I have since fell in love with my apple cider vinegar toner but I did really enjoy this toner while I had it while it lasted um, until my skin became a little bit more problematic then the apple cider vinegar worked a little better but I would recommend it and I would buy it again and the last few things that I have are all oils just different carrier oils I have grapeseed oil sweet almond oil jojoba oil and argan oil I have multiple oils because I use them for different things so for example the grapeseed oil is mostly used on my face if I'm doing like the oil cleansing method or something like that I'm going to be using the grapeseed oil for that the sweet almond oil I used to use it for my face sometimes I mix it with the grapeseed oil but now I mostly use it for my body I've fallen in love with apricot kernel oil so that is what I use for my body but I always love sweet almond oil next one is jojoba oil I can honestly say I don't care much for jojoba oil it doesn't do well on my skin um, and my hair I guess can take it or leave it so I probably won't repurchase jojoba oil it's not an ingredient that I necessarily look for in a product and the last one is argan oil I always like to have argan oil on hand especially to use in my hair so I will 
repurchase this so those are some of the things that I've used up over the past few months I really like doing these videos they are helping me to narrow down the things that I absolutely love and make staples and will continue to repurchase leave any questions comments down below and I will talk to you guys in the next video as always thank you so much for watching please live light love heavy and be well bye Yay! That was incredible.